Hello and welcome to a Smurd P video and I thought I'd do something slightly different. So um, Boom Studios in the, in the back of the the uh, 30th anniversary have put together this sort of reading guide and I thought I'd share this with um, with you in particular in, in, in slightly a little bit more depth just so you you can go out there and start um, if you're new to reading Boom Studios you can go and try and hunt these down etc. So going to sort of zoom in a little bit and just so you can see and then I'm just going to sort of read quite quickly so the right so you started rise of the of Draken so mighty morphing power rangers it says volume one to six but it's issue mighty morphing power rangers zero to 24 and then we move on to zoom in a little bit more to shadow grid which is mighty morphing power rangers so volume seven and eight after graphic novels in terms of issues, it's 25 to 30, and Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Shattered Grid 1. Then Go Go Power Rangers uh, Volume 3, uh, ish, and issues 9 to 12 of that. Or there is the hardback, I think, or graphic novel of Shattered Grid. So it would have been cool if they had Go Go Power Rangers in there as well. So you can see how that goes alongside it. Then you've got Beyond the Grid, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, Volume 9 to 10. Uh, and that is issues 31 to 34. Or the hardback, Beyond the Grid. I'm a little bit irritated that they didn't put, um, for number one, they didn't put that there was the year one and year two hardbacks. Don't get me wrong, they're very hard to get. Um, and if you look on Boom Direct, which is obviously a US... Uh, um, website from boom studios they do have those in there although they are a wee bit more expensive uh then we come around to necessarily evil now this has in terms of graphic novels mighty morphin power rangers 1 sorry 11 12 13 and go go power rangers 7 8 and 9 so in terms of mighty morphin power rangers this is issues 40 to 50 in terms of Go Go Power Rangers, this is issues 21 to 32. And then we've got the new Green Ranger, as they put it. And that is Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Volume 14 and Mighty Morphin Power Rangers 51 to 55. Now, this is when it starts uh, changing much to my dismay because I really didn't enjoy this. So, this, so they've called this Unlimited Power. Uh, and this has uh, Mighty Morphin Volumes 1 to 3 and Power Rangers Volume 1 to 3. And that has Mighty Morphin's issues 1 to 12 and Power Rangers 9 to 12 because they split it into two different comics, one following the Omega Rangers and one following the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Um, however, the story overall is uh, combined in them both. And then you've got the Aetherian War which is Mighty Morphin Volume 4 and Power Rangers Volume 4, and then Mighty Morphin Issues 13 to 16, and Power Rangers Issues 13 to 16. And then we go into the Death Ranger, and that's got Mighty Morphin Volume 5 and 6, Power Rangers Volume 5 and 6, and that collects Mighty Morphin 17 to 22, and Power Rangers 17 to 20, also, Power Rangers Unlimited, Countdown to Room 1, Power Rangers Unlimited, The Death Ranger 1. And then we scroll up to Recharge, which is um, it basically this is what I was saying about. They, so they split up the comics and they come back to issue 100 rather than just uh, go through them. And this is called Recharge. So this is Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Recharge Volume 1 to 3, and that collects uh, issues 100. 210 and now just so i'm you you understand we've only just started the darkest hour uh with 110 is the prelude to that just so i'm clear and then we've just had 111 released and um i can't remember when 112 is coming out but they've said that this is going to be mighty morphin power rangers recharge volume 5 volume 4 to 6 when those are released because i don't think if the issues haven't been released, these graphic novels haven't been released. So they're going to come out later in the year. So you, you could, in theory, go and pick up the individual issues. 
or you could just wait for the graphic novels. Um, and we've just um, started getting, in terms of the new Green Ranger, Mighty Morphin Power Ranger, sorry, we're just about to get a hardback in November of that new sort of era, so to speak, which goes on, f which starts that Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. So sorry, I should have said that earlier. So in terms of this, this is going to collect issues 111 to 122. This event is going to be over the next 12 months. So there we go. So um, I hope this sort of helps you. Um, I thought it might be quite good for me just to quickly do this because I had it. Um, this does not include um, other series or mini series and there have been a many of them all crossovers so just so you're aware outside of this there is crossovers with Teenage Mutant Turtles, uh, Justice League, uh, Godzilla, I can't remember if there's anything else, there has been mini series such as uh, Draken New Dawn which shows some of the coinless stuff uh, you've also had Go Go Power Rangers, which was a series of 32 issues. If I remember my maths correctly, and there's probably a bunch of annuals in there. There's also Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Pink. And there's also been some original trade backs as well outside of this, which I've not uh, probably documented. And maybe I'll do a video just to document them at some point. Uh, but for now... Power Rangers, Darkest Hour, Reading Guide. There we go. Thank you for watching. Take care. Goodbye.